Well, you can't win a championship on day one, but you can certainly lose it. So the majority of the fleet would have gone out today looking for a consistent day in big wind, big breeze, a test of fitness, but also a big test of skill. And I think looking at day one results, there's no surprises to see who's been at the front of the fleet. Uh, yeah, the first day today was uh, pretty solid. Um, I'm quite happy with the result today. Um, didn't manage to get off the start line too well in the first race, but then uh, ended in third uh, in the first race, which made the day quite, quite good. And in the end, uh, or in the beginning of an event, basically it is all about not having a big score. So I managed to do this, came through the day quite cleanly in amazing conditions. Yeah, this, uh, this World Championships uh, means quite a lot uh, to me personally because uh, it's part of my Olympic selection that is not done yet for us in Germany and it's uh, World Championships where you always want to do well. Additional to that, it's uh, World Champs in Australia, which I like, let's say. It could be a windy place, could be a windy week and it's uh, less than 200 days to the Olympics, so everybody wants to show kind of its strengths. Uh, Adelaide, I think, is quite similar to Melbourne actually, and I have obviously quite good memories to uh, Melbourne, where we had the Worlds, and I won my very first World Champion title. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm hoping I can do a similar kind of performance uh, this week, but uh, yeah, it's still early days. I had a very lucky or happy day today. Um, so yeah, it's a good start into the event. We've, uh, we've spent a bit of time here in Adelaide. It's not my hometown, I'm from Sydney, but it's a beautiful place. Weather absolutely turned it on today. We had really nice gradient, 10 to 20 knots. Can't really ask for much more for day one of the Worlds. You know, Laser Worlds, six days, we can get a bit of anything. I think maybe we'll have a bit more of this, that would be nice. We might get a bit of light. I don't think we'll see too much of, of windy, but yeah, you know, you're gonna get everything here, as we've seen already earlier in the summer as well. You know, we've got a really strong contingent, good bunch of guys in the squad as well. We've got five really, really good guys and we've all been pushing hard, backed up with a, a really solid futures group. Um, so yeah, the, the future of, of Australian sailing is looking pretty good. Mm -hmm.